Hello everyone, welcome to the Engineering Projects YouTube channel. In the previous video tutorial, we have developed a code to make top navigation dynamic. What I actually mean is that whenever I will create a link, it will get attached and bind to its associate location. Like if I will create a link for top menu bar, then it will represent on create here. We don't need to refresh the page again and again whenever we will create a new link. So we will do the same process with the bottom and for that we have main footer which is represented links here and these links are here in detail like the menu link menu is here in the main footer and the list menu list which is here is the main footer and then the engineering projects which I have created in the previous video tutorial for main top bar but there is a little bug which I have found and not explained in the previous video tutorial which is that right now what we are doing whatever the kind of menu is selected or what is the value of menu is selected instead of that we are direct extracting the data and appending them into the menu for that we also have to check the menu value so how we'll get the menu value is that you can go to menu links and here inspect that so here you will found 403 for the top bar and 404 for footer and you can extract that value from here you can copy this and pass a check what is that check you can simply say if this value is equal 403 I mean 403 by main top bar then it will represent in the top bar else it will represent in the bottom bar cut this page here now you have to replace the top bar ID in which we are appending the record which is created by the footer ID so how we will get the footer ID you can inspect this and from here you can get the footer ID now replace the footer ID in the next after copying this page here and change the footer ID now refresh the application so that the new code is get replaced with the current one and now whenever you will create for the top like I will remove this and refresh application now for the top what I will do I will say top one and use link this and click process the top one is added here because the top bar is selected but now if I will select main footer and say bottom one close this and bottom one and click process it is added here but it is not according to this for that we need to use this format we can use this format as this copy come here now there is another thing which is that we need to check how the BR is processing so there is BR and we need to process right away 
and we will use br in the last for the next link now we will simply replace this value this is for text and this is for link now just refresh the application once remove the record from here as bottom refresh the application now select footer and you will see when I will click process the footer link is added here so I hope you will like this video tutorial regarding dynamic footer if you have any kind of question you can ask us and don't forget to subscribe the engineering projects youtube channel take care bye bye